hello hello good people welcome back to the digital basement my name is junior and today we are going to be talking about stock x and how they are getting into the nft game uh, which to me will be a really big game changer so if you don't know already what stock x is uh, they are pretty much just a reseller of the hottest new kicks uh, sneakers from adidas to you know the michael jordan shoes nikes and stuff like that the exclusive ones um, and how they became big is because they were able to authenticate these shoes um, to make sure that they were the actual real ones uh, before people, you know, bought them uh, or sold them on their platform. Now, with them already authenticating, you know, physical goods, not only just shoes, uh, they authenticate a whole bunch of other stuff as well. As you can see from their website, they do... Um, clothing looks like they do video games there goes some legos here um if you haven't seen before the mischief blurs uh which i actually think kind of off off topic i actually think uh the newest one just came out yeah the fifty thousand one um blur i don't believe these are nfts i think these are actually just you know real like physical items if you purchase one of these blurred um you know <laughs> money images or whatever uh, you actually get a blurred money you know box or whatever that comes to your house um, and it's like a little rubber box that you can just kind of just sit there um, and they've been doing that I think for a couple years here now uh, looks like they got a couple of them the $20 one here was the, the first one that they came out with uh, that somebody purchased and now it looks like they're you know reselling it for $229 um, You can kind of see the uh, the historical data here as well. But again, to get back here on topic, uh, StockX really just resells um, items and they authenticate those items before they allow people to, you know, resell them on their platforms, purses, trading cards, all that good stuff. Um, so with them getting into the NFT game, uh, I believe this is right up their alley. This is 100% uh, something that they should have done and i am really happy to see it being done in a good way as well so here is their website in which they are talking about what they're going to do in the nft space um, they have something called the vault in which it is an actual literal vault that is at some of their facilities around the world and what they're allowing people to do instead of actually you know going to a shoe store and buying a pair of shoes or buying multiple pair of shoes and having to take them all home or instead of you know if you're a flipper in the shoe world uh, or even if you're a big sneaker head you know when you purchase one of these shoes you have to actually wait for them to come in I'm not sure what stock X shipping you know agreements are how long it actually takes to get to the consumer um, but it could be you know three to five days or something like that so once you actually purchase something you don't get to enjoy your good or, you know, you don't get to show it off to anybody else unless it's until a couple of days. Uh, what StockX is doing is allowing you to, you know, mint an NFT on the blockchain and having that NFT be your certificate of ownership saying that you own any pair of shoes that you purchase with them. Uh, I don't believe that it will be their whole entire catalog of shoes, uh, probably just a few of them here. But as time goes on, I'm pretty sure they're going to add more and more to the list. So just going to read through this real quick. It's pretty short. Um, Welcome to the future of Stock X, where authentic products of current culture are now on chain. Introducing NFTs on Stock X, new digital tokens providing unprecedented access and utility for the global for our global community these exclusive nfts connect coveted physical products with investable digital assets from sneakers to creators to experience and from sneakers to creators to experiences and more the future of culture is here so what this is basically saying is that when you purchase an nft from stock x you not only get an nft as a digital asset um, you actually get the physical product as well but if you don't want it yet which is one of the beautiful sides of their nft drop uh, is that you don't actually have to obtain your physical good just yet uh, so a lot of these nfts that are out there you don't actually get any you know physical good with it you just get all of the utilities that come with it uh, but one thing that stock x is doing is that they're actually going to 
ship you the shoes whenever you want it. Uh, until then, it's just going to stay within their vault. Uh, reading on, own the most popular releases digitally and start have or start saving on fees and closet space so you don't have to worry about having a bunch of shoes inside your closet each vault nft is tied to the same physical item stored in our brand new climate controlled high security vaults inside stock x facilities so if you're bullish on a shoe consider investing in a vault nft you take possession of the nft immediately after the transaction is complete meaning it is the fastest way to flip and I agree with this 100% once you purchase a pair of shoes and if you're a flipper you don't have to wait three to five days until you actually have the shoe you have your certificate of ownership you have your NFT saying hey I actually do own these shoes who wants them you know you guys can buy these from me right now uh, without having to go through the middleman of the mailman coming to your door dropping them off and then you have to sell them and then the mailman has to come back pick it up take it to you know whoever this bottom or whatever it really just cuts out on all that middleman uh, stuff there where you can just can keep all of your items inside the vault until you want to you know use it wear it or if you want to sell it uh, and with no shipping costs and market leading lower low seller fees at a fraction of the cost there's a lower hurdle for profitability uh, every NFT is mentioned on the blockchain, offering owners the opportunity to invest in current culture. With cross-platform liquidity on the horizon, owners may also receive exclusive access to StockX releases, promotions, events, as well as ownership. All right, then they have just a quick little roadmap here um, of what StockX is doing now, what's next for creators NFTs. You guys can go to the website um, and just check this out here as well. Uh, but I really just wanted to talk about how exactly is this a game changer uh, to me as I mentioned before one thing is that you know especially if you're doing resales uh, on StockX a lot of people invest in it you know reselling the shoes and stuff like that but now you can do it in a whole different way now you don't actually have to have the physical item anymore uh, and before you have to resell it it all just stays within their vault um, secured like they said it's climate controlled there's a lot of security around it and everything um, and stock X wouldn't be where they are now if it wasn't for how they operated as a company they are really big on making sure the consumer actually you know gets the product that they bought um, that it's not a waste of money I just saw I think it was like Logan Paul or whatever uh, bought X amount of dollars worth of Pokemon cards and all of them were fake or something like that uh, if they were an NFT, then it would have been authenticated and they would not have or he would not have lost any money on that uh, on that trade. With StockX, again, they've been authenticating, you know, shoes and stuff like that for years. Um, so it's a really big trusted company. So with them getting into the NFT space, like I said, it's, it's really right up their alley. Um, and I can see, you know, other things jumping off with it as well. Uh, I can see partnerships with Nike. Uh, or Adidas or any of these other shoe companies or purse companies and stuff like that where from now uh, you all you have to do is go to Nike and shop with Nike and let's say they had a partnership with StockX well once you buy a shoe from Nike you could say hey I'm not ready to wear my shoes yet just go ahead and send it over to my vault over at StockX and leave it there until I'm actually ready for it or you can just buy a shoe from Nike and then tell them send it to StockX and then you can resell it from StockX later on uh, you don't have to again go through the middleman of the FedEx driver UPS driver dropping your shoes off possibly getting stolen on your porch possibly getting damaged in um, transit or anything like that um, so that would be one thing I could see that you know possibly might come up uh, with StockX is that you know they do have some partnership uh, with some other companies in which you know just like you had on Amazon you have multiple shipping uh, addresses or whatever um, your vault you know could be a shipping address uh, for some of these companies and you can just deliver it direct to the vault and again you know save on closet space um, another thing that I could see since it isn't NFT uh, what if you bought other NFT products physical products from you know other companies and stuff like that um, let's say you bought a whole entire outfit you bought a pair of shoes from StockX um, I don't know some jeans from another company and a hoodie from another company well when you go to resell your NFT you can kind of group that all together you know as a as a three-part package deal 
um, your NFT of the shoes will no longer just be just a shoe. You will have uh, the matching pants. You will have the matching shirt. You will have the matching, you know, hat or whatever. Um, and that will make your NFT even more valuable. You will no longer just have, you know, the one NFT to sell. You would actually have a group of NFTs to sell um, that really nobody in the world would have, you know. Um, even though your shoes, other people might have the shoes, but do they have the shoes, the pants, the shirt, and the hat all to match together? Probably not. And the last thing that I can see is if you buy those shoes from StockX, um, let's say there's a, also a digital version of it that has been created or whatever uh, with the rise of the metaverse and everything. You can actually now buy your shoes from StockX uh, through an NFT. The physical shoes will actually live inside the vault at StockX, uh, but you own the digital version of it. Uh, so that way, if someone has some AR augmented reality glasses on uh, when they look down at your shoes, with their AR glasses, they'll see that you actually own those pair of shoes, even though the physical ones are in the vault, they'll see the digital pair on your feet uh, through their AR glasses uh, or, you know, inside the actual metaverse through VR technology uh, or through your avatar or whatever. You can actually wear those digital versions of those shoes inside of the, you know, metaverse and everything, uh, keeping your actual physical shoes safe inside of an, uh, a stock X vault, you know, right? Um, so yeah, those are just my two tidbits on what could possibly be the future uh, of StockX, you know, of NFTs and stuff like that. Um, I really want to know what you guys think, you know, if you guys have any ideas on what, you know, NFTs could be in the future as well. So some of these companies, uh, please do give me a shout out on all my social media handles are um, at junior underscore Evenso. Um, also leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think and I'll catch you all later.